Yeah, this is pretty much a road. Let's see. Oh god. It's a drop off. <laughs> we need to be on that road. What's up everybody? It's the T Dubs Kid and me and James here. Uh, James is from Kansas. This is his last day that he's gonna be here, so we're gonna do some cool stuff in the mountains. Uh, but we're on our way to Idaho Springs. And then once we get to Idaho Springs, we might eat some lunch and then we're gonna move over to Georgetown, but we're not gonna take I-70 to do it. We're gonna do it on all like gravel, back road, trail, trails and stuff. I found a way. Wow, look at that. Absolutely amazing. That's why I love this state. I've lived here all my life and I'm never planning on moving. Just look at that. Oh wow, I really wanna go up that road. Oh. I guess we're stopping here for a picture. Oh, there's another random dirt road that goes off somewhere. Oh, this is so cool. I'll have to come up here sometime and just explore. Icy road. It's like 70 degrees out here. Ain't no icy road. Just keeps turning and turning and turning. And then it goes straight for a second and then it turns some more. Well, here we are in Idaho Springs city limits. Oh my dear god. Yeah, that's a stop sign, right? Freaking white car almost took James out. Sons of bitches. I love being on a motorcycle like this because it's so easy to maneuver around. You don't have to pull forward, back up, pull forward, back up. So we just got some food. We're all filled up and we're ready to go over to Georgetown. There's a the gold man up there. Get your gold! Man, I kind of just want to jump in that river right there. Cool off a little bit. White water rafting! Woo! Turn here. I'm gonna go through this puddle. Ooh, goes down kind of deep. Is this a road? This might be a road. Let's see if this is the road. Let's see, oh God, it's a drop off. <laughs> we need to be on that road. I was hoping that road would have went back over to that road. Here we are. This should hopefully take us to Georgetown. Damn, this road is awesome. Hopefully we're going the right way. Ooh, it's a steep hill. Probably looks completely flat from the GoPro angle. I'm actually just about to hit 4,000 miles. I'm at 39999 on this bike. What a great place to hit 4,000 miles at. Like, look at that view. You just can't get as good of views taking the interstate as you can doing all them back roads. Oh, damn, dude, it's an old mine. Let's check this out. Do you think I could get the T-dubs in there? I could get it in there, it'd be kind of hard. Damn, look at this. Oh, it's so cool in here. I feel that. Yeah, it's just collapsed, but it's kind of cool, though. I mean, if you go past that part, it keeps going, but that's pretty dangerous. Hopefully this doesn't fall on our heads. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't do it. Yeah, dude, because I don't, it might not go out anywhere else. That might be it. This might be the only exit entrance. Look at that, it goes way back there. That mine was really cool. James actually wanted to go 
like deeper into the mine because after that little cave-in part like it was pretty much clear but I just told him it, it wasn't a good idea like it's just not worth it on those old mines man because if that like entrance caves in more we're, we would be like trapped in there and I've just heard like bad stories and stuff about people you know going in mines and dying and shit we haven't run into one soul out here it's completely barren is that a road what is that looks like a sort of road yeah let's turn around dude okay. yeah my bad damn my damn gps was taking me back to i-70 i don't want to get on i-70 with all the the tourists i want to take on dumb dang old back roads man now we got a douche fan the rules you follow the power lines you took it right to georgetown oh damn there's a road that goes up that way there's so many freaking roads around here I could spend weeks exploring this area. It's absolutely beautiful up here. There's like a whole like network of freaking roads and trails up here and none of them are really marked at all. Oh, that's like the first sign I've seen. Oh, holy shit, dude. Where, where did he go? I'm coming for you, James. You all right, dude? Yeah, yeah. Did you fall over? Or? Well, my bike died and I don't know where it's coming from, but it's good now. Okay, it just died? There's an actual sign up here. It actually says Georgetown, go this way. So that's like the first sign we've ever seen. Ooh, take a little shortcut through here. Give me some racket road ice cream. Oh, it's getting easier. Wow. Another awesome, amazing view. That's insane. That might even be Georgetown down there. Georgetown, this way. Another amazing view. Wow. And the thing is, the GoPro just isn't gonna do views like that justice, like no camera can. It's just something you have to come out and experience for yourself. Find some awesome views near where you live. I'm sure there's got to be some good views everywhere in the world. Some are better than others, but definitely if you get the chance to come out to Colorado, you gotta like check out this road. It's absolutely breathtaking. I don't need no Jeep Rubicon. I got a dual sport. I think it's easy roads from here on out. I don't think they're open, bro. Oh yeah, they're not, huh?